sorry, th there is virtually nothing I've not said in the course of my presentation. This is an initiative that we must all partner with, including you guys in the media, to fight against this menace. No matter what percentage, I don't want to believe in the street statistics. I, don't, I am not private with that statistics. But whatever the case is, in respect of the statistics you have mentioned, I believe, I believe the fact that this menace, this problem of drug abuse, rape, is quite prevalent in our societies. And we must rise, we must rise jointly to fight it. And the only way we can succeed in doing that is bringing everybody's hand on deck. The media guys, those opposed in the legislative institutions, the executive arm of government, even the judiciary must have to take our laws seriously. Enforcement of laws will have a very serious role to play as far as this fight against drug abuse is concerned. Some of our laws are not only obsolete, they are quite insensitive. Some of the laws do not, have not been able to spell out uh, extent punishment. Sanctions are quite on the low side. I wouldn't mind if there is a possibility of perhaps capital punishment may be too much, given the kind of society we are operating. But there is no amount of punishment that can be too much for a rapist. Rape is, is, is a calamity. Rape is worse than even the pandemic of the COVID-19 we are experiencing. It's killing the society. Why would you allow all those things to continue? I also look at, in, I look at the matter inward. From the perspective of the instrumentality of legislations, we as an institution have a role to play. One, in the first place, most of these relevant agencies that have to work and fight these uh, vices are underfunded. Underfunded. If you look at how other countries around the globe fight these kind of vices and menace, they have very good organizations. They are coordinated. They are given a lot of resources. So it's now left to, to, to organizations, uh, relevant organizations, to look forward to the National Assembly, especially now that it is timely. We are engaging on the budget. Let them come up with their schedule of programs. What do they want to achieve? Where do they want us to help them? We partner and we provide necessary resources for them to function effectively and in the overall interest of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and Nigerians. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.